gonna talk about two really great examples of salvaged denim that you can pick up. Uh, they are from Left Field NYC. This is 18 ounce salvaged denim. These, they do three different fits in the 18 ounces. There's the uh, greaser fit, which I have here. There's the Atlas and then the Chelsea, which are a bit on the slimmer side, but I like a straight fit and this is the greaser fit. So this is what I'm gonna be talking about. I bought one that is uh, loom. This one is loom and this one is slubby. So uh, you don't have to buy both like I did, but you can buy one or the other. Um, I like, I couldn't decide which one I, I tried them on in store. And if you remember, if you watched the left field NYC uh, CJ shops video, uh, we te he teased a little bit of uh, these coming out and then when they launched uh, I went in tried them on and because they are shrink to fit so I couldn't normally I have uh, three pairs of left field denim and there are 31 these I had to go up to 33 because these are shrink to fit and so I could I think I put on initially I put on a 31 and I couldn't close it because I was like this is what I normally wear and then so he said, you want to go to 32? I was like, no, let's go to 33 because I could tell that I, it wasn't going to close. So these are 33. If you're wondering, my, I'm, in, I'm wearing right now 22 ounce uh, iron heart and these are 32 in the waist. I normally do 31 throughout most of my denim. Yeah, throughout most of my denim, I do 30 and some 30s, but maybe not anymore after the pandemic. <laughs> but uh, 33 because they did a little shrinky shrink. They did a hot wash and a dry on these so that they won't shrink anymore. And then the details on these, if you remember, I'm gonna go into them as well. Very impressive. This, I'm really digging. So these 22 ounce iron heart, I really got into like a nice, thick, heavyweight denim. I really like that, especially in cold weather. It's just, it's nice. 18 ounces is gonna be great. I'm very excited to try these on and wear these. Um, unfortunately, I have two, and so I'm even going back and forth. So I'm like, which one do I start to wear? Because I, I will probably wear them every day. For example, I wore these Ironheart 20, uh, 22 ounce for about, no exaggeration, I wore them four weeks straight. <laughs> so I want to do that with one of these. I have to figure out which one. But I'm going to try them on so you guys can see them, see the fit. Uh, I like the greaser, like I said, because it's just a straight fit, and I'm not really into too much of like a skinny, a skinny fit, especially because I want to be able to get uh, the shaft of my boot um, over the leg and not have it kind of like where you see where the shaft is when you move on a skinny jean. I don't really like that. So we'll go into some of the details on these. Uh, you know Christian at Leftfield does really great work and pays attention uh, to all these details and holding these up as long as I have right now. <laughs> my, I'm feeling my arms start to burn. So let's get into the details um, of the left field 18 ounce greaser. Over one month later. The first pair that I'm going to show you is the 18 ounce slubby. I wore these, these probably have about uh, two weeks wear. And this is what they look like now, kind of shaping to my body, as you can see. Uh, I am not wearing a belt, so you can see the waist on the pants. And I started with, I don't, I say, why did I start with the slubby? I think I was kind of excited just to see how they would look after a few wears. My pockets are empty, so you can see the shape. Normally I do have, you know, some coins in my pocket, my phone and some money. So you can see I took everything out so you can just see how the pants kind of drape. This is the 18 ounce slubby denim from Collect Mills Japan. And it's with one wash, a hot dry to remove any of the shrink. So you can see how they look. And the shirt I'm wearing is from Grown and Sewn. Just to show you all around how they look. 18 ounce dark denim with that thick vegetable tanned bovine leather patch you see. And then they have the green painted Scoville tack waist button. 
It's just really nice. So now I'm going to put on the greaser, the loom state collect mills so you can see how those look on. Now those I have not worn versus these, which I have worn. So those are going to look a hell of a lot different <laughs> because those still have the tag on them. So I'll go put those on right now. Now I'm wearing the Greaser Loom Stay Collect Mills Japan. These I have not worn at all versus the others I've, like I said, I wore quite often. Still has a tag on the back as you can see and they have a very strong scent of indigo <laughs> because they have not been worn. So the, uh, the Loom Stay Collect Mills, um, Loom State means that it is the raw off the loom. So there's no sensation. Um, which means it's like the most natural state um, with the maximum texture and softness in denim. So that's, this is what you're getting with these. I should, I should have started with these, but what I'm going to do is I'm taking a trip pretty soon and it's three weeks, four weeks, something like that. So I'll probably take these. I'm trying to decide which pair. I only want to take one pair of jeans. And if I take these and wear these for four weeks straight, We'll start to get, they'll drape nicely. You can see these kind of, they're the way they're draped now. It's just, they're not shaped to me like the others. And again, I don't have a belt on, so you can see that thick vegetable tan bovine patch in the back and the pockets, you know, nothing in the pockets and like the others. So just wanted to show you guys what the greaser fit looked like. It is a favorite fit of mine because I do like a straight fit and I can fit the shaft of my boots um, the under these. So that's usually why I like something that's a little bit straighter fit. So there you, this is the greaser 18 ounce denim by Left Field NYC. Left Field NYC greaser fit denim. This is an 18 ounce dark denim. Thick vegetable tan bovine leather patch a hidden selvage coin pocket, flattened copper rivets to look hand hammered with a pick and shovel logo, green painted Scoville tack waist button, and a nine ounce cone white oak coal miner bandana. 